Hi, I'm Jade. If you don't know me already, I blog over at Late for Reality. I've decided to do something a little bit different, so I'm going to be featuring monthly favourites on the channel, and I'm going to kick it off with my August monthly favourites. So first things first, my favourite makeup item of the month. I picked up this Makeup Revolution palette recently from Superdrug. They sell all of the Tam Beauty range, which is Makeup Revolution, MUA and Freedom. They're all really low budget, but actually the makeup's fantastic. Their lipsticks are, start as little as, I think, a pound, and I really like them. Their matte lipsticks are fantastic. I picked up this Love the Revolution palette. I've really wanted the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance eyeshadow palette for a long time, but it's about £45 and I just didn't have enough money to justify £45 on an eyeshadow palette. So I was looking for something similar with the same sort of colours in it and I came across this one. So this is the colour that I really love and I think in the Anastasia palette it is called Love Letter. That was the main colour that I was looking for. So I went into Superdrug and I had a little hunt around and this wasn't actually on the shelf. Uh, I asked the lady if she could just direct me in the way of a palette that had that colour in it and she managed to find this one for me and it was actually on offer. It was down to £4.50 which is obviously 10% of the price um, of the Anastasia palette. My second favourite of the month is a foodie favourite. Um, I've been doing Slimming World for god knows how long now, months and months, since February or March and sometimes I come across things that are a real treat on Slimming World. This is the Aldi Passions Deli Popcorn in Sweet and Salted and this is only five and a half sins per bag. It's a nice treat, I love sweet and salted things, um, so really nice treat. So if you're on Slimming World or not on Slimming World, they're really good. I've managed to get Joe into them as well because they're a little bit healthier for you than the Butter Kiss Popcorn. My next favourite is a TV show. We have gone through most of Netflix now and every now and then we find something that other people have recommended to us. Now lots of people have been talking about 13 Reasons Why and I thought that I would try it out. Within one episode I was hooked and I think it took me about a week and a half to watch the whole series. Absolutely love it. If you haven't seen it already, you should watch it. If you've got Netflix, flick over there tonight and pop 13 Reasons Why on. Trust me, you will not regret it. I would love to know what you think of the show and the storyline, what you think about the main character and her intentions and all that sort of thing um, because it's really sort of, I've heard some really mixed reviews on it um, and I'd really be interested so let me know in the comments what you thought of Hannah and the whole sort of concept of what happens in the series. Okay, so the next thing that I'm absolutely loving is my Ed Sheeran CD. I know that his album's been out for quite a while, but Joe bought me the CD recently so that I could have it in the car. My car's quite basic and it doesn't really have a USB stick to plug my phone in, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, he bought me the CD and we've been listening to Galway Girl on repeat in the car. It's really uplifting and a nice, fun song and Ted really enjoys it. He sings along to it as well and... Yeah, that's my favourite song of August. My next favourite is a film and it is the film Life. We watched it recently and it was such a good film. At the end of it we were both really surprised. Um, it features Ryan Reynolds and Jake Gyllenhaal and some other actors which their names aren't in my head but I just get stuck on Ryan Reynolds. But yeah, Ryan Reynolds and Jake Gyllenhaal. It is a sci-fi film thriller I believe. It's set in space, it may or may not feature an alien and if you like the alien films then you'll probably love this. It's a bit jumpy but it's well worth watching, we really enjoyed it so Life is my film of the month. And my final favourite, I probably won't have this every month because I'm not going to be touring the world on a monthly basis but it's my favourite country of the month, Czech Republic Prague. We went to Prague this week and we just got back. We're going to be doing a video of 48 hours in Prague to show you guys whilst we were there. I went along with Joe and he was working so I tagged along 
and it was amazing. So 48 hours, we just sort of explored the city, had a wonderful time and it's just beautiful. If you haven't been to Prague already, I highly recommend it and I think we're already planning our next trip back. It's absolutely beautiful, full of history, really, really lovely place to go. So, so don't forget to come back for my 48 hours in Prague video and next month will be my September favourites if I can remember to film them. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon.